Now in this session we will understand the meaning of cube root of unity cube roots of Generally what happens that number of roots of any polynomial equation is equal to the degree of the polynomial. So if we are given to solve x cube is equal to 1 so this implies that this equation should have three roots but what we do we take x is equal to 1 by 3 and the cube root of 1 is 1 so we we observe that the answer is 1 but there are two more roots no doubt they're not real but they are the roots so in this we will understand in this session we will understand that what are the other roots and what what is their uh, importance and how they are important so instead of taking cube root it's better to apply in the equation x cube is equal to 1 it's better to apply a cube minus b cube which is a minus b into a square plus a b plus b square is equal to 0 so now when we apply this we get either and with that x becomes 1 or now this is the crucial part and since we cannot split the middle term so we apply a discriminant method which is x is equal to minus b under root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a with its general or usual meaning so now when we apply x it turns to divided by 2 which is so since the square root has a negative quantity inside so this cannot be the real answer no doubt it is the imaginary answer or the complex answer so what we do we introduce iota and you can see that there are two roots and the other one now if I have to give the name or it's the general thing if one is called omega then the other turns to omega square so sometimes we also call it w and w square but this is omega and omega square so there are three cube roots of unity one omega and omega square omega and omega square are conjugate of each other and as you can see one is the square of the other that is uh, in, in imaginary roots if I do the square of omega, it will turn to omega square. And if I will do the square of the omega square, it will turn back to omega. And the important property is and the highly used property is 1 plus omega plus omega square is equal to 0. That is sum of all the roots. is equal to 0 
and also omega cube is equal to 1 that is the product of all the roots is equal to 1. So they are not highly so they are used in complex numbers determinants matrices and the rule is very important and it's widely used so uh, we hope that you so we hope that you've got the idea of cube root of unity thank you